Boss has spoken. <laughs> How's that? Good. Dr. Surgeon come. Thank you. Thank you very much. Gary. This has been spectacular. Everybody can hear me? Okay. Yeah, of course. Anytime. It's been an honor to be here. Especially when Rosemary invited me. It's also been honored to be part of a crowd which supports what happened. Doesn't matter which year this happened. I know some, some of you might be thinking, oh, it's way in 1973. Has it changed? Can anybody say, has it changed? No. We still have that threat here. We still have that threat. I want every one of us to be alert, to educate ourselves and to educate our kids how to be safe. I'm honored to be with uh, the Senator of New York. I used to work in New York City a long time ago during Mayor Giuliani's time in 9-11 time. We still had the threat at that time. Nothing has changed. I know there are wonderful kids around here in this park. Are they safe? No. Why are they not safe? Two-legged animals are there, somebody said. That's what we are here for. We need to support Rosemary. Rosemary is one of the mother of John. There are many Jones are here. Every day this is happening. Everybody can Google and see everything is happening. I was honored to be invited here to speak on this. But I'm shocked. I'm really shocked. What should we speak? And it did touch my heart a few minutes ago when she said, please listen to all the speakers. Because Joan is speaking through the speakers. And that's true. A seven year old girl gets, gets this. Where is the life? What happened to her sweet life? Her brothers are here. They all are shocked. Somebody happens in their own neighbor doing for the Girl Scout. There's a Girl Scout table right there. A wonderful girl representing the Girl Scout. Please come over here. That's one of John. Yes. Why she is not here today? Can anybody answer that? Why she is not here today? Only because we were careless. It's all because we were careless. And today I can say this because it happened in my life. My, son, my other son's best friend went through this because of cyberbullying. He committed suicide when he was 14. I witnessed it. I was coming home from work. I heard my son screaming. I said, what happened? No, my friends, the father called looking for you. I said, why? He said, I don't know, but he was crying. I jumped in the car and went to his, uh, went to his home. I saw our ambulance and our fire brigade, everybody is there. What happened? He couldn't open his mouth, he couldn't say anything. So I asked the officer what happened. He said, uh, this child died. I said, what? He used to come to my house every single weekend. He used to love eating. 
He used to sneak to my pantry closet and eat because his father was never in favor of, you know, junk food. 14 year old. I did everything. I, in this, in this two hand, I had to carry him. I had to put him in the graveyard. I did it, so I know what this means. This is, this is really too much. And you know why this is happening? Because we don't have love for each other. The senator is here from the lieutenant, uh, from the prosecutor office is here. I have one of my best friend here who works for my law firm. He used to be a prosecutor. We are, he used to uh, uh, lead uh, the uh, human, uh, human trafficking. That's another thing, cyberbullying. I was asked to talk about cyberbullying. What is cyberbullying? What is cyberbullying? We all have cell phones, right? We all have cell phones. Why don't we use it improperly? Why do we have to use for cyberbullying? This is what happens. Again, I'm really thankful to Rosemary for having me here today. I will do anything and everything possible. And we will work together to make sure. I want everybody to work together. One last thing. Where is the senator? Senator is somewhere here. We all are pro promoting job creation, right? Economic creation. But we don't talk about love creation. We should really create love. We should listen to the kids, what they go through, and we don't do that. Thank you very much. There's a table of uh, voice of the kids. I champion to them. So please visit. That's the voice of the kids. The kids is the voice.